So, Keho Bay has been listed under the United States Environmental Protection Agency as impaired water under the assessment unit number HI713293 by the state of Hawaii, okay? And impaired water, it's um, declared because it tur has turbidity, which uh, turbidity is measured of water clarity, how much the material suspended in water decreases the passage of light through the water. Suspended materials include soil, particles, clay, silt, and sand, algae, plankton, microbes, and other substances. Of oxygen. These suspended materials can clog fish gills, reducing resistance to disease in fish, lowering growth rates, and affecting egg and larva development. As the particles settle, they can blanket the stream bottom, especially in slower, slower waters and smother fish A is actually supposed to be cleaned up. There's supposed to be a plan in place to help clean this water. It is proven that development actually destroys. It actually, it causes more silt to run into the water. We have rain here. It's right across from Kahalu'u, both properties um, are not used but for the public at all. Kamehameha Schools wants to develop Kahalu Keho Bay and destroy a whole entire ecosystem there instead of using these properties that they've already developed and they haven't been using. This property, I haven't seen them use for about 30 years. It's, it's never been used the whole time I moved lived here. So anyways, I just want to let you guys know they have other possibilities that they're not using and this property they could make a lot of uses of it instead of developing and destroying a whole ecosystem in Cahill Bay.